I know that something I really value in a youth space that Vox has introduced me to is um, giving young people opportunities to define like how they want, how we want um, the organization to be run on all levels. Like I'm part of the board, so I make decisions at that level. And there, I'm also an editor, so I'm a peer leader in that way. So I think giving young people a really concrete voice that's not just tokenizing, but actually like you can see the results of your voice um, is really empowering and feels really good within a youth space. I can say, what has made me feel like I belong in the organizations that I'm a part in, what's made me stay, is like the family-like traits that they exemplify. So I know at Vox, they actually try to make, every staff member tries to make a connection with every Voxer that comes in the building. Same thing with Voxers. They try to make those connections to get to know who we really are. And I can say, Amongst the uh, organizations that I'm a part of, that's been the biggest thing that has kept me there is being able to call them friends, family, being able to invite them to your social events because that's the type of relationship that you're able to build. I would say the um, the way that the adults are definitely sets the tone in terms of, um, I think that we are kind of on the same playing field in terms of um, voice, you can express yourself freely without um, the fear or judgment of um, adults um, in in a controlling way. So, one of the most important markers of quality in a youth group is uh, having an open forum where everybody can learn from and build upon each other. I am a member of my school's robotics team. What initially drew me to the team was the robotics element. But uh, the team also does uh, a lot of community engagement. And uh, I really enjoyed some of that stuff, including the gaming nights for the school, uh, the Habitat for Humanity build. One of the things that really surprised me at Vox was like, whenever I like, my first time like sort of writing an article, I was really hesitant on what to write and everything. And, like once I talked to my mentors, they still remembered what topics I was doing. They sort of like guided me through the process. So that was really, sort of bringing the connection, um, bringing inclusivity into everything. There's like no sort of fear of judgment. So um, like whatever you want to talk about, I feel like they really mentor you well. The, the best way I can like compare being included to um, feeling where you belong is to track teams. Like for example, my club track teams, it's like everyone has the same goal and that's to be better. So we all come together as like a unit. The reason I was attracted to Vox or wanted to join is because I really, I not only wanted to, but I felt the need to like expand my horizons past my school. So I was sort of looking for like a way to grow my skill set and also meet new people. And I felt like after new member training that Vox was a place that I was going to be able to do that. And I think that makes it really quality because it's beneficial in the way of like learning and growing and like teaching people. And I think one of the biggest things that makes it quality is that like everyone feels heard and it is very intentional in that way. That's the same for me. No matter what organization I'm a part of, especially Vox, we accept all for who they are. And there is it's like a really big no judgment zone and you feel it while you're there, always.